Hello everybody, it's me again, Kid Lot, back with another commentary on Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3. And today's topic, I want to talk about getting out of your comfort zone. And now, this seems really obvious, you know, you hear it in real life too, and you know, I've always heard it too in other commentaries and topics about Call of Duty videos, is that people don't really get out of their comfort zone, they use the same weapons over and over, and they rarely want to try something new. Now, that's all something that we already know. What I want to focus mainly on this topic is... The, the the mentality the growth mentality of a player why people actually you know stick to the same weapons use the same things over and over why people kind of have that mentality and why people don't want to get out of their comfort zone and so you when you when you first talk about this you have to first step uh, back all the way into the beginning when the game is first released when the game is first released you know everybody is you know doesn't really know what the game's about it's new to everybody and you're trying to figure out a way to be really good you know that's the first thing you want to do when you play like for example, a Call of Duty game, you want to find out the best weapons, the best things to use in order for you to do really well. And so that's why people, you know, pick the best weapons. They use the same thing over and over because they're really conscious about trying to do really well in the game. And that's fine and dandy. And that's what also people do, you know, when they get the game, or when they first get the game, these new players that come in, they do the exact same thing. They want to find the easiest gun to use, the guns that will get them kills, that will get them results really fast. And I have no problem with that, but this is where the growth kind of stops pretty much. People always kind of stay in that area the next step obviously is when you're comfortable with the game when you're you know you feel really good with the game you know that you can get kills and all that stuff the next thing you do is to try to branch out okay i know these guns are really good but why not try these other things out you know there are over 40 guns in the game so why not try different stuff out that i haven't tried before and that's kind of the next step after that first initial step is to try new things you know use different equipment even just try new tactics and all that stuff not use the same things over and over and that's how people People, you know, get out of their comfort zone, really branch out and enjoy almost all the aspects of the game. That's what I do. And that's what I, you know, aim to do with this channel is to try to get the most, right? Get the most out of the game possible. Like I purchased this game. I want to get the most experience out of it. And that's what I do when I play the game. Just try out different weapons, different tactics and make videos about that. The unfortunate part, like I said before, is that people always get seem to get stuck on that first step. They always, you know, use the same weapons that are easy to them, but they're really just content with with that they don't want to you know use anything else because all they're focused on is just you know killing you know they're really self-conscious about trying to do well and their stats and all that stuff me I, d I don't even you know do that at all if you go back to black ops right remember black ops had the combat record you would see there that every a lot of people would just use the same weapon they would have like 13,000 kills with the weapon but the next thing would be like only 2,000 kills it'd be like 13,000 kills with the famas maybe like 4,000 kills with the ak-74u and then like it's a really big drop off after that none of the other weapons are being used at all with me it was the total opposite in black ops you would see my top five weapons all very similar very you know the tips of the bar they're all next to each other it was like not even the most powerful weapons it was like the m16 remember how people didn't even like that weapon the ak-47 the aug and things like that there were just different weapons that i used because i get the most out of the game you get the most fun out of the game when you just throw away this idea of you know being self-conscious always trying to you know only think of the game of getting kills and stuff you get a lot more fun just exploring the game and trying to figure out different things and that's what i kind of want to preach in my channel and this gameplay is to try different things and try new things you don't you know first you know it's understandable first get comfortable with the game know the weapons that will get you kills and will deliver results for you that's good but you should be at that step already if you are you know if you're going positive too that's like a big sign that okay i'm actually doing something good you know what i mean i'm actually things are actually working in my favor i'm actually getting kills but after that step you know it's you know it really isn't fun anymore to keep using the same you know if we're talking about modern warfare 3 it's not really fun to use the same pp90 over and over and over again for every game and just you know rack up kills and all that stuff it's not really that fun at all the most fun comes from you know leveling up different guns getting gold guns with all different guns not just using the same three guns over and over i would bet too if you would look you know if there were combat records in modern warfare 3 people would actually be the same exact thing as in black ops there would be like 
you know, a lot of kills with one weapon, and then like the rest of the weapons would be a really deep drop off after that. And even myself too, if you th if I think about it right now, I I followed the exact same pattern when Modern Warfare 3 was first released. You know, I really didn't know anything about the game. I wasn't actually good with the game. You know, I had to fix my controls and all that stuff. I remember like this is like the biggest thing I remember. I remember always using silencers on my weapon because I was so self conscious that I couldn't kill anything without silencers. I couldn't kill anything without giving my position away. Because because I wasn't good at defending myself from people who were rushing me, constantly like rushing me all the time. I needed to have a silencer all the time when I played. And you know, even in LMGs and stuff like that, I always had a silencer with me. And now that I got more comfortable with the game, now that I, you know, took the time and spent the time to get better at the game, you know what I'm saying? That's the whole thing about, you know, competi a competitive game, right? Call of Duty is a competitive game, so you have to spend time on it if you want to get better at it. And so that's what I did. I spent more time with the game. I kind of understood the mechanics and how the game played and all that stuff. And once I got better with that, I didn't need that silencer anymore. I didn't need that crutch, you know? I kind of escaped that first step that I was talking about and moved on to being comfortable with the game, trying new weapons out, trying new things out. And that's how you have the most fun with the game. It's not about a stat, okay? It's not about you being so desperate that you have to use the same weapon just to get the kills in the game. No, you should be at that level, but when you get to that level, branch out, try something new, get the most fun and experience out of your game. Anyways, my name is Kalada. I hope you liked that commentary. Until next time, peace, guys.